Coach Kading. Runner-up finish it looks like for you guys for, my, for uh, Mount Carmel here at the uh, Dvorak, 28th Annual Dvorak. First off, close to home, high level wrestling. What's it like being able to come, you know, drive an hour and a half and get two hours, however far you guys drove. What's it like coming and having this type of competition in your own backyard? Oh, we've been kind of gearing for this. You know, this is this is part of our, our training process of what we're trying to do for the end of the year. And uh, we, we've been kind of, you know, getting ourselves amped up and, and revolving our training around what this tournament was going to present to us. And uh, we're excited to be here, you know, and uh, we're excited to see how we compete against some of the other state, you know, and for that matter, nationally ranked wrestlers. So, and uh, we're just real excited to be here. Florida team catch you off guard a little bit? Yeah, they're tough. They're real tough. And, and you know what, you got, I mean, Montini's just, they're tough. I mean, Glumbard North is always tough. I mean, there's just teams in this tournament that, you know, are just state powerhouses. And, uh, uh, you know, it's just fun to see this kind of competition. This is why you wrestle. This is why you train. This is why, you know, we, we do the sport that we love. And it's to see competition like this. We've seen you guys as Iron Man. We've seen you guys don't you don't hide from competition, Coach. No, we don't. We don't. We took away the Iron Man a, a few years ago. We haven't gone back, but we, you know, you can't you can't hide. We're in the Catholic League, you know, with Marmion and Montini. Uh, you know, we see so we see top level competition all during the year. You know, we see Lockport. We see we see all these tough teams that are in the state. We saw uh, Lincoln Way West and and uh, Crystal Lake Central at another tournament that are. Uh, state ranked, uh, you know, two A team. So we try not to avoid the competition, and uh, we try to mix competition into what we're doing training wise. Because ultimately, February is what counts. Looking at, you know, you guys' state tournament series. You guys recently, I think, the last three years, you went to three divisions, right? Yes. And what What do you think that did to, to the state of Illinois? And did that really kind of? What do you think that did going to three divisions? You know, I don't know what it did. You know, uh, you know, I, I got some old school mentality towards it, and, and I, I do got some you know new school kind of thought towards it. You know, I can see both sides. The the reality is is that I can tr I don't control any of those decisions, and neither does my team. So, uh, we, you know, we just try to we try to put the, the best product on the mat, and, and whoever the state says is our competition, that's who we go wrestle. You guys have a really strong duel series here in Illinois. I like the duel series. I like duels. I'm a fan of duels. How are you guys as a duel team? We're actually very good as a duel team. I think we're very solid, and I agree with you. I think that's what our, our, our sport in general is missing. Uh, it's, the, it's the lack of a really team concept. I think uh, sometimes it, uh, we get caught up in the individuals, but in order for our sport to survive, I'm a firm believer that the team aspect has to survive. So I look forward to it. I know um, we prepare, the coaching staff prepares our guys for the team aspect of what's ahead. Looking at the Ohio teams, the Iowa City West team, and the, uh, the Florida team, what do you think out-of-state people are thinking when they leave this tournament? I think that they know, you know, obviously, you know, people who follow Fargo and off-season wrestling know Illinois is a top wrestling state. It's, it's for sure a top five wrestling state. So anytime you come here, you're going to get good competition. So, you know, I, I welcome it. I love new blood into the tournaments. I love out-of-state competition, you know, coming in. And it's a different look for, for, for our guys. So. What do you try and push Mount Carmel guys? Illinois, Northern Illinois, you try and keep them in state. Do you, uh, I don't know, you're in Oklahoma, you're Sooner, you yeah, know, I Boomer, to, right? I went, to, I went to the University of Oklahoma, so, but I'm originally from Illinois, so, you know, um, I don't, I just, I just want my kids to wrestle, you know, and, and, and if it leads to them, you know, uh, you know, wrestling on the next level and getting part of their education paid for, then, then job well done to my coaching staff, so, you know, it, I really don't care, you know, I'd like to, I'd like to keep the Illinois boys in, in state, but, you know, sometimes it, it works out better to get out of state. All right, Coach, you got anything else for me? No, I appreciate it. Thank you. Hey, thanks for the time. Yeah, no problem.